So it's interesting if you have a, a WordPress site or a website and you're using Google Analytics, uh, which is a, a JavaScript based analytics product, uh, you've got it installed on your site, you're looking at live traffic, you're seeing countries that are visiting and so on, and you think you have a pretty good sense of what is hitting your site, what's making requests to your site, but there's this whole underworld that exists in uh, on the web and uh, for your WordPress site, if that's what you're trying to secure, where there's a lot of traffic that you don't see because that traffic actually doesn't execute JavaScript when it visits your site. And that's a requirement for Google Analytics to log uh, a request. And a lot of other analytics products out there are JavaScript based. So when I wrote the original version of WordFence, one of the features that we actually launched with was live traffic. And that live traffic is uh, PHP based. So it actually shows you um, all of the requests that are hitting your web server and doesn't require uh, whatever is making the request to execute JavaScript to be able to see that request. So if you go to uh, WordFence's live tra traffic, which is off by default, uh, but you can turn it on, you can actually see all of the requests that are being made to your website, including the stuff that GA is gonna log and the stuff that is not being logged. And you'll realize um, how many bots are hitting your site, how many crawlers are hitting your site that don't execute JavaScript, how many brute force attacks are occurring, uh, how many exploits are directly trying to access a path that goes after a plugin. And you begin to realize why you need multiple layers of security to secure your site. It's very interesting and it gives you a real sense of what's going on.